What is up, my crazy square? This is Joking John City 4 here, bringing us more Black Ass 3 multiplayer. Hopefully, you guys do enjoy this gameplay because I managed to go 48 kills with 18 deaths. So, anyways, uh, today's uh, topic is about Black Ass 3 in general and uh, what's been happening the past two years. So, uh, in the past two years, you know, Call of Duty Ghosts and Advanced Warfare were not that good. The reasons why is because Advanced Warfare. Um, the jumping thingy, you know, with all the exosuits and that stuff, you know, it was just too much. It was just too fast. Everybody was jumping all over the goddamn place. The accuracy was super low. I bet you, like, everybody had super low accuracy. Nobody could aim. And also, another thing about Advanced Warfare. There was only two guns that actually worked. ASM-1 and the BAL, and that's it. It was a BAL and ASM-1 game. You can choose either one, and those are the only two guns. That's it. Because uh, the rest of the guns in Advanced Warfare, they all sucked. They didn't do any kind of damage. So, uh, all you have to do is just trust on the ASM-1 and the BAL. Because that's the only ones that's going to get you around. And actually kill some enemies, like, instantly. So, uh, Call of Duty Ghost. Call of Duty Ghost was made by eSport players. And they don't want to admit it. But they were the ones, you know, uh, who wanted to turn the game into tournament-based games. And pretty much we got Call of Duty Ghost. And the problem with Call of Duty Ghost was the kill streaks and the way the game looked. Uh, the maps were terrible. I don't know what the fuck happened there, but that game sucked. And also the spy plane, you had to put down those little boxes in order for you to get a spy plane. And nobody was usually use them because you had to put them down. You had to put like around three of them and then you get a spy plane. So what's the point, you know, of getting that if it's, it's going to get destroyed? Like you really can't do anything about the spy plane so now everybody's playing a hide and seek game that and everybody ended up you know pretty much um using headset whoring and you know a lot of people just can't and wait until the enemy pass by and then they can hear the footsteps and that's how everybody played and that's why i ended up quitting that game like within three months so uh, because i'm a rusher and as a rusher you gotta be moving around, you gotta be getting into people's faces, but if everybody's camping, there's really no action, there's really just no way you can actually find them first before they find you with a headset whoring thingy. So, um, that's why I believe Call of Duty Ghost was bad, because you can't do anything. The rushers were dead, they killed the rushers because, you know, the headset whoring and the spy plane did not work. Um, also, the camping was just too much, man. There was just too much camping. That was the best camping game of all time. But I'm not. I don't want to camp. That's the thing. I I don't not. I'm not really to participate in camping at all. Cause I'm a Russian. I don't like camping, man. I like to get my kills all badass back to back and shit. So um. So yeah, that's the thing about Call of Duty Ghost. And then um. Now we got ourselves Black Ops Three. Black Ops Three. I believe it's a great game. I think it's a good game because now you have a chance to actually still jump. Uh, running walls, which is not a bad idea. It's most of the time you don't even use the wall running. I'll say like maybe 20% of the time you wall run. 20%. And then the jumping thing, maybe like around 30% of the time, 40% of the time you end up jumping, which is not a lot. So that's good. You know, it's kind of staying. It, it kind of like like wants to go back to traditional ways, which is okay. You know, pretty much we all wanted another Modern Warfare 2 or a COD 4 remake or a World of Wars and like that. It's kind of going back to its original roots, like where we all didn't used to jump. So, um, if they were to do that, that would be great for the next COD. But as far as I know, you know, I don't, I don't think Infinity Wars is going to do any good. You know, I know they're going to fuck up at some point. But, uh, you know, Black Ops 3, they kind of, you know, believed in the old school system. And uh, I think this game kind of feels like that. Even though we had the sliding thing, even though we had the jumping and the wall running, it's still not a big effect in the game because... You know, most of the time you'll find your enemies just staying still. And that's the difference between Advanced Warfare and this one. That in Advanced Warfare, everybody was jumping up and down like crazy. Everybody was too fast. You couldn't aim at them. This year, you can aim at them because all you do this time is just glide across the sky. Like, that's it. That's a super slow glide. So... You have more chances to actually win in this game. You have more chances to actually kill someone in this game. And all the weapons are usable so far. Hopefully they don't nerf all the weapons. Because that would suck. Because that's what they did in Black Ops 2. They nerfed all the fucking weapons. And you can barely use any. So, um, that's just our hope. 
they don't go nerf crazy because the quick scopers are crying. Because I remember what happened in Black Ops 2. The quick scopers cried all the fucking time saying that this gun is too is too badass. This other gun can kill everybody too quick. And they nerfed the PDW, the MP7, the Scorpion Evo, MSMC, uh, all these other SMGs. You know, they all got nerfed because the quick scopers, quick scopers cried too much. So let's hope this year the quick scopers, please do not cry. Do not cry, please. This game is already good. So... Uh, so yeah guys, that's it. That's what I want to talk about. I think Black Ops 2 is the best game so far in the past two years. And let's just hope it stays like this. Infinity War and Sledgehammer games, do not fuck up the next two the next two games, please. I want to play Call of Duty. So, I'll see you guys later. Subscribe for more. You guys want to see more Black Ops 3 multiplayer.